so many more years left in this game. I feel like I can beat everybody. Whether I knock him out, submit him, TKO him, I will get my hand raised. That's the only reason why I'm fighting. That's the end goal, becoming world champion. My confidence is growing. For me, there is no one in front of me. I'm the number one. But I know that confidence comes from hard work. I work so fucking hard. Siéntate, amor. Ya está listo. I feel very happy right now. Every day I wake up, I say to myself, you have two options right now. Keep dreaming with your dreams or wake up and make it reality. And I choose the second option always. That's why I feel very happy and it's very hard to be the happy man. Qué buena pinta tiene esto, eh? Thank you. You more than welcome, princess. I met Georgina six months ago after my fight with Bryce Mitchell. She's doing everything she can for me. ¿Cómo sería? De nada vale tenerlo todo si no tienes con quien compartirlo. What's life if you can have everything but no one to share it with? Gracias, <laughs> She's always pushing me and telling me that I'm the best. She's like putting my confidence in the sky. My job is more to support him. So whatever he asks me for certain stuff, it's easy for me to do it. Like we have a very good relationship that we communicate very well. So it's great. She got like the same mentality I have that success is when you're happy with yourself. I always wanted to live here in, in Florida because I, I know that I can improve in a lot of things in my life here. But it's hard to be without my son. Hombre, pero si es Huguito Topuria, hombre. Pero si es un hombre super guapo. ¿Cómo estás, mi amor? His name is Hugo Topuria. <laughs> He's three years old. Te he echado de menos que llevo días sin hablar contigo. ¿Dónde estás? Estoy en Miami, mi vida entrenando aquí. Eh, Hugo, ¿vas a ver mi combate o no? Sí. It's very hard to balance that, but I try to do my best. I have to give him like a bright future and I have to work for it. Tienes que ser el campeón. Hola, un campeón de la bala. Y el papá tiene que ser campeón de la UFC. Díselo. De la UFC. Después te toca a ti ser mejor de algo, eh. Muy bien. Mándame un beso, no te voy a molestar más. Mira, 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 papá. Te amo. I always try to have like my feelings in another side. I have to work following my dreams. And that's it. Uh, I will be back in five weeks. I'm gonna see him, I'm gonna give him a life that I never had. And that's a motivation for me, of course. I come here because the fight is in Florida and I wanted to come out from my comfort zone. Here in, in Florida, I have partners with a lot of experiences. They had like, a lot of fights in main events and I tried to learn a lot from them. I tried to improve, to learn. It's to take my confidence in another level. Always looking for a challenge. That's the, the main reason why I'm here. This is his dream, and he's following his dream, and I admire that. I always tell him that the more he trains, he's just getting more and more confident, right? Everything he does, he wants to do it like 100%. So for me, it's amazing to see him train like this. I had a goal since I was a kid, and the person I have in front is a stone I have in my way, and I have to take it out. This kid has a ton of hype around him. 
It is justified that people are excited. Ilya Tapuria is a straight up assassin. KO for Ilya Tapuria. Big shots. Oh, he heard him. Ryan's in trouble. Oh, big ground strikes from Tapuria. Ilya Tapuria has knocked Ryan Hall out cold. This kid is a finisher. Ilya Tapori is the real deal. Vamos con bloqueos arriba. Otra vez. Hey. My next opponent is Josh Emmett. Una más. Josh fighting style, it's perfect to knock him out in the first round because he has like a very standing boxing style. He didn't have head movement, not good at the ground, not good cardio. You are going to see, I'm gonna put his lights out. This win, without any doubt, gonna put me in, in the conversations for a title fight, so. I'm 100 times more motivated than Josh, and I'm gonna prove that I'm the best in the world. So you're good with bell pepper, red onion, and mushroom, and spinach? Yep. OK. Everything okay. works. You want help with anything? There's been a lot of dark places throughout my career. Oh, how many eggs? You want three, three. eggs? Three eggs? Yeah. But there's also been a lot of like happy and, and a lot of light. Yeah, if I had to describe my career so far up to this point, it's like a road that's just constantly going like this. You think you're coming to the top, and then you got another just dip in the road. That would be the best looking omelet ever. That's just because you're hungry. To get on the biggest platform in the world, in the UFC, you have to have a strong, strong support system. Vanessa, my wife, love of my life, we've been through so much. I feel like I should be doing something. I'm just sitting here waiting. <laughs> waiting <laughs> no. to be fed. <laughs> Josh is very resilient. Life has thrown a lot at him, but he's always just bounced back and come back stronger. Vanessa and I have been together almost 20 years. I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for her. You put a, a ton of spinach in there? Um, I will. Yeah. She helps with everything. Like, I literally could not do this without her. With all my sacrifice, she sacrificed just as much. Vanessa being there to support me, win or loss, um, yeah, it means the world to me. Moment of truth. Moment of truth. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. as a team, got here. We've got here together. People that will sacrifice their lives in order to help you achieve what you want to do. Four slip. There you go. It's been rewarding, it's been challenging, and I'm always up for a challenge. Good. Again, out of hook. Good. I'm trained to win. I go out there, I win. I used to feel invincible. No one could beat me. And every time I would touch these guys, they're falling on the ground. There you go. Good sweat going. I was on a five-fight winning streak. And that's when I fought Yair Rodriguez for the interim featherweight title. The moment has arrived for Team Alpha Male's Josh Emmett. At long last, his first crack at a piece of UFC gold. I already played this out in my mind thousands and thousands of times. Oh, oh there's a bite crushing I body of. kick for Rodriguez. Oh, Emmett clipped him with that right, though. Josh Emmett did everything he could to prepare for Yair Rodriguez. Oh! It was the biggest fight of my life, and it, it wasn't my night. Ooh. It's all Yair. Josh Emmett backing off. Elbow hurt him bad. Oh, oh 
my goodness. Yeah, he's just ferocious. I made a big mistake, and, and it cost me. And there's the triangle. He's going to pull it down. He's going to lock it. Oh, that's in. Oh, that's locked up. That's he's it. The, he taps. That's Yair it. Rodriguez, UFC champion. It felt like a bad dream. And I could just see it in Josh's face. Like, he just was going over every detail, every move, every mistake in his mind. I just didn't want him to stay in that place for very long. Of course, it was heartbreaking. I wanted to be a UFC champion. It was another pain, a little bit of adversity I had to take on the chin. I just wanted to get back to the gym and then get back to fighting because I want to erase that. And here we go. I, I got another one coming up. Force nothing. Keep your balance. Good. Good balance. There you go. Just flow. The power will be there when you flow. Beautiful. At this level, it's hard just to get a win. They're all supposed to be better than them. They're all going to be faster. They're all supposed to be the better boxer, the better blah, blah, blah. That's what the media says. We don't give a shit about that. Bring him back high. The last five seconds, you're going to push as hard as you can. As right, long as I prepare him. Push it, 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 push it. To be the best Josh Emmett. Time. Nice. There's no one that could beat him. Good. Conditioning is there. Everything is there. Sharp. We're ready. I have a tough opponent in front of me June 24th, and I can't let my last outcome affect this fight. Ilya Teporia, he's good. He's young, he's hungry. I know how he's thinking, going out there and finishing everybody. I was there too. I beat the best guys in the world. I beat guys in the top 10, the top five. I have to get through him before I can even think about becoming world champion. That's the only reason why I'm fighting. ¿Cómo estás, bien? Todo bien, gracias. ¿Cómo vas? Qué guapos están los coches, eh? Este no es el modelo nuevo. If I have the opportunity to drive a nice car, why not? Lamborghini or Mercedes or whatever it is, it's part of my life and I love it. ¿Ustedes van a subir o no para la pelea? Grande. Claro que sí. I love that everyone can feel the confidence I have in myself because I work really hard. It means that we are doing a, a good job. The people want to see me. I enjoy everything right now because I feel very happy about everything I have achieved in the sport and I know that I work harder and smarter than anyone in my division. I know that. Ilya Tapoya is a real assassin and he's got his hands full tonight with Bryce Mitchell. This is an amazing fight. Generally, you don't get two undefeated young guys that get this deep and then they match up with each other. Whoever wins this fight goes to the absolute top of this division. In the Bryce Mitchell fight, in the first round, I catch him with a couple of right hands. Then he was able to take me down. That surprised me a little bit. zapoya has got to be very careful with his defense here, because Bryce is a finisher. Then I go to the corner, and they told me that he was very tired because of all the pressure I put him in, in the first round. I'm a special guy. I have to hold it. I start up with I didn't know it. Who brought it? And the second round, I connect him with some combinations. Oh, and a right hand knocks Mitchell down! I knew that I was better than him, so I knew that I could finish him. He taps! Wow! Ilya Topuria submits Bryce Mitchell! 
I feel very satisfied after the fight because I put a lot of work. It doesn't matter what, what, what people say or what, what people think about me. I know that I'm going to be the biggest superstar in the UFC because of all the things you are going to see. That's it, work, Elias. Let's work, yep, yep. My fight style is beautiful. I enjoy watching myself because I see so much technique. Good wrestling, good ground game, good cardio, the best. Keep on it, stay on it, stay on it. The head coach is Henry Hoff, he's a striking coach. I have very good relationship with him. We have really good communication with each other. It's always good to listen to someone who has so much experience and who works with so many guys. Take your shots. He's just a complete package. He's like really, really good everywhere. He sees a lot of things that a lot of other fighters don't see. He stays really calm. Consistency and discipline is very important. If the consistency and, and discipline goes away, you can lose to a guy like Emmett who has knockout power, you know? And he's so close to title shots and winning the belt that you just need to stay focused, you know? And I think uh, we can help him with that here. On him, on him, on his body. The belt is waiting for me. It's achieving a goal that I have since I was a kid. The fans are gonna enjoy a lot the energy I'm gonna bring, the style I'm gonna bring, the fire I'm gonna bring inside that cage, they really gonna enjoy it. Hey, you okay? Hey, hey, stop for a second. Finger? Get him out. It was an accident. It happened. It's part of the job. I mean, what we're talking about here is two incredibly elite athletes, both pushing themselves to the limit. Even just watching it, it's like, I think just such a horrible <laughs> performance. It, it, There's so much more I, could, I heard him there, so much more I could have done. I usually sit like this, kind of hold myself together, and I've been doing that since wrestling. <laughs> <laughs> she was never excited to watch me f wrestle, oh, fight, nothing. It was awful. Mm. I've gone through a lot in my life. It was tough. My mother, I just see all the struggles she went through. That's why I feel like I owe her so much. Oh, oh this is the one that you said, right? Yeah, this, he catches me in a triangle. I missed the whole triangle thing. <laughs> I didn't think you know what a triangle is, huh? I don't. <laughs> Since a young age, I'm like, I'm going to buy my mom a house one day, but we actually built her one. <laughs> entertain, entertain us, mom. My mom was looking at other places and you know, the market's super high right now. And so Vanessa and I were talking and we're like, hey, let's, let's just build a place in our backyard. It was a lot, a lot that they gave up for me to, you know, to be here. This is it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I even have my own lock and I can remember. <laughs> <laughs> it's a one bedroom house. Like it has washer dryer, it has everything. Nobody expected it to be this big. I really haven't had someone to look out for me. We, um, his dad and I divorced. Josh was, you know, two, three, two, three. I, I felt like it was just chaos growing up, especially with my older brother. He got involved in drugs, and he was in and out of county jail, prison. Police always at my house. I never knew what to expect when I got off school and I would go home. That's the reason why I was doing martial arts at a young age, because I wanted to be there to protect my mom if I needed to. After my older brother's murder, it hurt so bad for so long, I couldn't even talk about it without a bunch of emotions coming out. Having Teresa in a safe place has always been one of Josh's number one priorities. It only made sense to have her close. 
the appliances, everything in here is top of the line. <laughs> and then this is the other part of it. This is where I work. He's got the best heart of everybody I know. I'm grateful, I'd say, that I'm his mom. I didn't really expect it to be so nice. After everything they've been through, they're in a safe place. Supporting my mom, my wife, it's a huge driving factor for me. When I'm sore, or beat up, or banged up, and I don't want to get up and go train, I think of my wife, I think of my mom. I owe them so much. The harder you push yourself now, it'll be easier later on. Good. Extraordinary performance requires extraordinary sacrifice. Stay light on your feet. Good eyes the whole time. I've sacrificed so much in my life to get to where I'm at. Good. Move your feet, poker face. And I feel like I have so much more to accomplish and achieve. There you go. Yeah. Good, uh, good selection. Good. Ilya Taporia. I think him and I match up really well stylistically. You know, he's he's a powerful puncher, boxer. But I think I have more power. Every strike I'm throwing, I'm trying to finish the fight. That's right, make it hard, there you go. Getting prepared for Ilya, we have to tighten up our game in all aspects. Wrestling, grappling, striking, um, making sure our defense is okay. Most importantly, cardio. Time, breathe. All good thoughts, find that place. Find that place. I've faced opponents like him, and he's never faced anyone like me. You're a beast. You're mentally the strongest person in the world. There you go, champ. He's young, he feels invincible. He can say or think whatever he wants. Like, I'm gonna finish you in the first round, I'm gonna finish you in a minute. You That's go. not gonna happen. He may be overlooking me, but that, that's his fault. I have the experience on my side. Woo! It'll make him like you. He's gonna learn real quick. If I can do what I'm capable of. Shit. I'm gonna break my fucking hand. There's no one in the world that can beat me. It's gonna be bright in your eye. Sorry. I'm gonna need, how many stitches am I gonna need? I don't know yet. I haven't seen it yet. 35. No. <laughs> no, that's not bad. That's not bad. Probably about two or three. Cool. That's all. But he's lucky. They had to put me four stitches. <laughs> it didn't affect me at all in anything. I want to keep with my trainings. I'm going to do all my training sessions. And I will be very healthy in the fight. He don't will be able even to touch my, my face. He's too slow for me. Yeah, and I'm too fast for him. He don't gonna touch me. And you are going to see that. Once again. He can say or think whatever he wants. He's gonna be in a, a world of hell when we fight. The big win over him, it gets me right back to where I was at, fighting for the title. But I have to get through a dangerous Ilya Tapora first. I know that I can be the biggest star in the UFC because I'm bringing a new style. I'm a very complete fighter. If you're good at striking, I'm gonna take you down. If you're good at wrestling, I'm gonna knock you out. You're screwed everywhere. Doesn't matter for me, I promise. Because I'm going to be a superstar, a legend in this sport.